Yeah, no, New Zealand schools squad is, is an exciting, exciting group of lads. Um, it's been a lot of work going to into finding out who are the best 26 in the country, and it's been a tough job. But we've got a really good crew. Uh, we've got boys who you know, we can be physical and get our set piece right. But we've got a pretty exciting set of backs as well. Who hopefully we play a good style and they get good opportunities to show us what they can do. The quality of the first 15 footy this year has been great and culminated in the top four a couple of weeks ago which was a, which was a great weekend so it has been tough and there's, there's, there's some pretty disappointed boys who have just missed out and there's disappointed boys who haven't made the bar bars so I mean, that's the way you want it, you want the boys to be able to, uh, you know, a, a good competition and, and that's what's happened. There's at least three or four boys who have come come through and I know a couple of them actually came to us in the schools at the end of the campaign last year with a couple of injuries so you know they, they, they're, they're um, obviously got a bit of a feel for what it's like to play uh, to play a test match and but I suppose it's going to be a bit different actually travelling to Australia so uh, no, they're going to bring a bit of experience and, and, and you know it'll be, it'll be great to have them amongst us. We got a bit of a scare against the Fijians last year, and there's some pretty, pretty impressive athletes in, in that side. And I'm sure they'll be the same, and they'll be ready to have a crack at us. And then the two Aussie sides who are obviously sitting there waiting to have a crack. So she's not going to be easy, but that's what we, the way we wanted, and, and a good challenge. Being a backs coach, I'm, I'm pretty excited about some of our backs, and we've got some really big midfielders, and there's going to be great competition. You know, we've got uh, Purnavai, Tawada, and the two Hamilton boys that. Uh, you know, uh, who are going to be battling out for that midfield spot, and uh, mate, all really exciting players. And then we've got guys on the on the wing who can finish. So, look, without singling out anybody, mate, there's some there's some talent there. Last year was a little bit of the unknown. Came in from out of the super and uh, straight into it. So this year, I've sort of had a bit of an idea of what's going on, and mate, it's great to work with the kids of this age. And you, you sort of got to alter how you how you get your message across at times. The boys are a little bit different to. You know, to professional rugby players, and they may may need a few different ways of getting information across. But but generally, it's it's really exciting because they're so you know they're like sponges. They're keen to learn, but um, they're keen to have a bit of fun as well along the way, which is pretty much how I operate. So that's going to be great.